Hi everyone, here is our math problem for today. Without using a calculator, which is larger, 1.005 raised to 200 or 2? You can pause the video and see if you can solve this quantitative analysis problem. Now let's solve this problem together. Since we are not allowed to use a calculator, let's break this 1.005 into some fractions that we can deal with without so much computation. We know that 0 0.005 can be written as a fraction 1 over 200. 1.005 therefore can be expanded as 1 plus 1 over 200. And we just copy the exponent. Now, for those of you who are familiar with the Euler number E, you know that the limit of 1 plus 1 over n, all raised to n, as n approaches infinity, is the Euler number e, which is approximately 2.71. And notice that this form, 1 plus 1 over 200, all raised to 200, is similar to this form. But this equation at the right gives us the upper limit when n approaches infinity. Here, 200 is nowhere near infinity. We only know that this has an upper limit of about 2.71. So still, this does not prove that this number 1.005 raised to 200 is greater than 2. So let's go to another approach. What we are going to do is we just expand this given expression into these factors. Since the exponent is 200, we know that we are going to multiply the base 200 times. So this is our expansion of 1.005 raised to 200. Now let's go to the number 2. This number 2 can also be written in fractions like this. 201 over 200 times 202 over 201 times 203 over 202 all the way up to 400 over 399. And there are 200 factors here all in all. Notice that we start with 201 in the numerator followed by 202 followed by 203 all the way to 400. So that means there are 200 factors all in all. Notice also that in the denominator, this is always 1 less than the numerator. Also notice that the numerator 201 and this denominator 201 can be cancelled out and so all the other corresponding numerators and denominators at the middle. What's left at the numerator is this 400 and what's left in the denominator is this 200 and clearly 400 divided by 200 is equal to 2. So we are going to work with these two expansions. One for 1.005 raised to 200 and the other one for 2. Now let's look at this first factor here. 201 over 200. This can be written as a mixed number 1 plus 1 over 200. Now the second factor 202 over 201 can be written as a mixed number 1 plus 1 over 201. Then all this in the middle will have the same pattern and then 399 over 398 is equal to 1 plus 1 over 398 and lastly 400 over 399 is 1 plus 1 over 399 and this is equal to 2. Also, we know that there are 200 factors here all in all. Now, let's remove this middle equation and let's compare these two expansions. There are 200 factors at the top and there are 200 factors at the bottom. And so we can compare factor by factor all these 200 pairs of factors. So let's look at the first pair. 1 plus 1 over 200 compared to 1 plus 1 over 200. We know these two factors are equal. Let's move to the next pair. 1 plus 1 over 200 and 1 plus 1 over 201. So the difference is we have here 1 over 200 and 1 over 201. When a fraction has the same numerator, the fraction with the lower denominator is greater than that fraction with higher denominator. So we know that 1 plus 1 over 200 is greater than 1 plus 1 over 201. So this factor at the top is greater than the factor at the bottom. Look at this next pair also. 1 plus 1 over 200 and 1 plus 1 over 398. So this denominator 200 is lesser than this denominator 398. So this top factor again must be greater than the factor at the bottom. And let's look at the last one. The same explanation, this fraction is greater than this fraction at the bottom. So except for the first pair here, all the corresponding factors of the expansion of 1 plus 1 over 200 raised to 200 are greater than the corresponding factors of 2. And so our conclusion is, even without using a calculator, we are sure that 1.005 raised to 200, which are equivalent to these 200 factors, must be greater than 2, which is equivalent to these 200 factors at the bottom. And so for our final answer, 
1.005 raised to 200 is greater than 2. And we do not want to know what is the exact value. We are just asked to prove that one is greater than the other. So thank you very much and we hope to see you again in our next video. Bye for now.